G'day guys, it's Tiberius from Empire Geek and joining me today is Knowles from Knowles Gaming, so hello. Hello and good evening, how are you? Good, I'm trying not to cough. <laughs> as soon as you said it's my intro, I started to cough. <laughs> <coughs> oh, yeah, sorry guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, uh, oh, gee, what were we doing last time we were on? Um, um, I can't remember, but... I'm... You finished this thing. Yeah, that's right. So I did finish this. I don't know if I showed you guys, but um, I simplified it and... Left half the solar panels over there. Uh, no, nah, I didn't. We dis dismantled them all, remember? No, nah, like over there on the base. Oh, yeah, right, right. Yeah, I'll, I'll eventually move those and put another one of those solar array things up. Yeah. But yeah, I built that. I can't remember if I showed you guys, but um, it works. Works really well. Should um, we shove the underground entrance to it? Oh yes, let me run over there because flying seems to be a bit scary at the moment since the trees have all disappeared for me. I removed the trees here. Oh, well, that's good. <laughs> So this is our monstrosity. I don't know if you remember, but I created a crater, so we had to fill it in. Yep. And Tiberius did a lot of work on uh, tidying this up down here. Yep, made so, it a nice tunnel. So it's all nice. It's got our little aesthetics design to it. Bit of overgrowth yep. as well. A bit of lag too. Yep, yep. Oh, lag, lag. <laughs> If you're wondering why we're lagging so much, it's not because there's a lot in here, it's because of the incomplete stuff. My project. Yeah. yeah. So I used one world up before we do anything, but yeah. Yeah, so we might as well show them the progress. Oh yeah, um... That. That is not what you think you know it's... It looks like that. Yeah, I know, I was about to say it's not a penis, by the way, guys. <laughs> but, um, it is. It really is. The idea for this <laughs> come from our little, um, what do you want to call that thing up there? Bloody, um... Landing platform? No, the thing attached to it, the glass windows up there. We thought it were, what was it? Oh, the airlock. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, the insp inspiration for this come from that. It was going to be the same size as that that's airlock. That's usually on your head. <laughs> okay. It was going to be the same size as that airlock, but I figured I might as well add a medical bay to it and uh, cargo space and stuff like that. So mm. this freaks me out every time I walk over it. Does it? Yeah, because it... In real life, the stuff freaks me out. It freaks me out now because it looks like it's not there half the time when I'm yeah. working on it. But yeah, um, I decided I'd add in like medical Section. room, cargo container, um, you should have these at any of the golf box. Yeah, I should, but I'll work on it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the idea for this, guys, is to be a platform exactly like this, kind of, the one outside, but um, it's our, our halfway marker, so how we keep talking about having a platform mid air. Um, yeah. th that's what this is, so we'll get halfway. Um, dock to this resupply if we have to and then continue on to space yeah exactly. so, so that's what this is so it's, it's going to be a not a permanent structure because I don't think we can get a permanent structure up there um, uh, no no but it, w it will be a ship so I, I do need to I'd hate to guess how many solar panels you'd need for a permanent structure yeah. Just how to keep the thrusters going and random window. But that's what I've been working on while we've been off screen. Um, yeah. I'll then... finish the shape language of this. Yeah, so the whole idea of that midway platform is to sort of like the landing platform itself, like that one up there. Um, it's, you know, it'll be about the same size, but it's going to have the middle cut out to the same shape as this. So that yep. all it does is just dock. Um, and then, you know, dock right in the middle and then continue straight up like it's going to, should perfectly fit right in the middle of it, if I plan it out right. 
I think the last time guys watching this were watching me just basically uh, disassemble and reweld large cargo containers because I can figure them out, but I've got them all figured out. There's the conveyors in the center, if you can see that guys there. So, just need to put a skin on it and make it look half decent. Looks good though. Figure that's the sort of style I'm just going to replicate. Yeah. Every time I see it, it looks like it's complete. And then we come on to the monstrosity that has been continuously, uh, <laughs> <laughs> continuously <coughs> holding. And the us. current bane of no, uh, Noel's um, frame rate, something or sim speed. Yeah, only because of our unwelded blocks that are here. Which props to uh, Tiberius if we go. No, this one. I think last time you guys were on, I think I was up to here ish with the floor. Yeah, now he's um, expanded a lot um, as well as adding this doorway here and touching up the inside. If you want to have a look. So let's, let's peek through. I love that. <laughs> Shit, that was loud. Yeah, they're really loud. So this is our inside, guys. It's been touched up mm. a lot. The bat wing is currently sitting inside due to the fear of having it hit by asteroids. <laughs> yep. And it's come close a couple of times, so I moved it inside. Our little uh, walkway has changed. Now it uh, yep. protrudes through the middle. And then if we take a look up here. You can see I've added a whole other section. I haven't welded the windows yet. Yeah, so this is... probably also not helping us in speed. Mm. Looks good though. I like the uh, progress you've made with it. Like in what this is only hmm. probably a third or a quarter of what's what's to come. I mean there's still like a quarter I'd say. Yeah. Guess. There's still like three quarters left of the hangar to do and then obviously the building of Actual the ship. ship itself <laughs> which will be enormous. Yeah. But that's where we're at for the live stream uh, save, yeah. save guys. We should have come up with a better name for it. We should have. <laughs> we should have. We well, did if you guys have any suggestions, <laughs> let us know. Them. We did have a uh, a impact on this <laughs> by um, by some meteors, if you remember that. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. It's when you guys weren't watching, of course, but um, it was a bit funny. It was round about here-ish. Yeah, somewhere in the middle. Didn't yeah, do too much out. damage to Cloud Light. Took out one of the big windows and then like four blocks. So it will protect what's ever in the hangar, which is good. Yeah. And hopefully the turrets do their, their job. Yeah. Well, when I finish welding up the windows, the next thing I'm going to do is actually plumb those turrets up there into the base. That's what this is for. <laughs> Yeah, I really should change the look of that bloody, uh... The, um, the so got, yeah. project I'm working on. And it plumps into the thing. And fly down here. Uh, that's gonna be a lot of conveyors to weld up, but anyway. And plumb into there. So yeah, that's how I'm gonna plumb it into the base. I was very disheartened when this down piece came exactly in line with this hanging door. So, I have to figure a way around that. In case you guys are curious as well, I, I do intend to actually put a proper door on this thing. I have no idea if it'll work, but I will build it and crash the game. <laughs> and then load a backup. Yeah, I'm thinking we'll have to do it out of um, 
armor blocks. It's gonna be a heavy blast though. That's yeah, gonna be another nine bits of build. Um, where are you? In the penis. Huh. Changing up the uh, corner blocks that you were criticizing. Criticizing. Medical component. Yeah. Because I was gonna put those, those just triangular ones, but uh, um, outside. It's not that. It's I don't think they quite seal up the the gap properly I from think they do. past experience. So using those ones was more of an option. And the weird thing is, guys, uh, base actually pressurizes, which freaks me out every time. Why am I stopped at the moment? Because I've got this open here. Why are you? I don't know about you, but uh, I'm trying to weld these windows and nothing's happening. Do you have windows? Yeah, it says I just need block proof glass. And yeah. I've got no bulletproof grass. Never mind, I thought I had it. It was displays. I'll come to it. <laughs> yeah, displays. Yep. Don't mind me, guys. Just having a uh, engineering. Awesome. What, what do you call it? Writer, writer's blog. Writer's block. Writer's block. I'll call it engineering block. Uh, Crash. Uh, I refill my hydrogen bottle. Do 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 do. I think this is the first time people have seen me fly this. Nulls. Yeah, I think so. I mean, just have the other side to do. Yeah, I just want to make sure I don't fall to the ground because I don't know how heavy it is at the moment. This won't fall, I've got a landing gear on it. No, me. Keep going. Very nice. And now I've got to do more windows. <laughs> Display computer. Oh. That was convenient, wasn't it? It was. Um. Yeah, stop drifting. So, guys, this thing's quite nimble until I fill it. And then it's all over the shop. Oh, we missed the window. There we go. I blame you. Alright, so we need medical components. Medical components? You should build one of these. Yeah, I really should, shouldn't I? I should just build a drone and have that do all the work. Yeah. Program it to a uh, weld. Yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> Thank God. I thought I was going to fly into the side of the uh, okay. wall of Mexico. Alright, I made a cool component. If Mexico pay for the world, do you reckon they get to name it? I don't see why not. They're the ones bloody building it. If 
you had God to name it, what would you call it? Um, ooh, good question. Um, the giant taco. The giant taco. <laughs> Not being racist or anything, guys. Just stating the obvious. That's true. Why are my medical components not building? Uh, missing component, or are you doing it in the deleter? No, I'm doing it in the builder. Well, then we might be missing silicon because I built a ridiculous amount of bulletproof glass. Yeah, but it says we have need silver, iron, nickel. And it looks like we have plenty, so why am I? You might need to empty the um, assembler, it might be chock full of silicon or something. Amazingly, guys, I've had to crash this world the ship twice. Meteor storm inbound. And that makes me nervous. Perfect timing. Maybe in the base. Come on, door open. That makes no sense. Assemblers can't go in the call. I control you right now. But you'd probably get revenge on me. Uh, maybe. What you doing, Nels? Trying to work out this stupid assembler. Energy low. Yeah, it says we're missing iron and silver, but it says that we have tons of it, so. Yeah, I know why. I don't bloody know what's going on. There's 127,000 silicon and 180,000 large cargo. Yeah, but we still have plenty of. Um... No, the um, assembler's full. Why can't I see the. Okay, maybe we're just short on on um, materials. I have no. Nice. Ow! That ship's doing the stupid thing where it sinks when you're not flying it. No need to worry, I managed to build the medical bay. Well, the assembler's working again. Yeah, I just took the uh, rest of the medical components I needed out and decided to work. Oh, we don't have silver. That's why. What are you talking about? It says we do. Where? Our oh, silver. That's probably not enough, 1.37 kilograms. 
Alright, we turn this reactor on. Okay. Okay. God damn it, Nulls. I have a shade you, I also, um... Made one of the small doors sensor. Yeah, I kind of locked myself in, sorry. So, yeah, I'll show you. Yeah. Give me a second. Just need to... Put some uranium in this damn reactor so I don't lock myself in. When I finish this door. <laughs> Alright, so, got that working. Huh. Now I just need to map out the rest of, uh, <laughs> rest of the... With these corners, windows are already welded. Uh, uh, I should be working on this little thing, actually. Which means I need steel. Well, that looks sad. Okay. All right. So, which door censored? Uh, the first one. I think I just crashed my ship. I didn't hear a crash sound. What I did hear is like a banks, a small bang. No, I wrecked it. <sighs> Typical, I record and then it's the day I freaking crash my ship. Well, yep. <laughs> Coincidence. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, I see. Any cosmetic damage? Yeah, and two thrusters. Have all this crap. I would love to turn this base into our mobile space station. It'd be hard. It would be. We'd have to mine it out really well. Do -do -ding. I'm afraid that means that that's it, guys. Yep. Thanks for joining us for this rather short episode. It feels yep. short anyway. It doesn't feel like 20 minutes. No, it doesn't, but um, we want to keep it short for you guys. We don't want to drag it on too long, but... Um, yeah. Also short little episodes. Yeah, but because we've... Most of this was just you guys catching up on what we've done. Um, and me crashing my ship. That means the next one should be more... Interesting. More interesting. More interactive. <laughs> More interactive. So thank you all for all joining right. us. We'll see you all for the next one. See you next time. Ladies. Ladies.